I mean, uh, and still young. I mean, still a junior sophomore class, but a lot of guys that's uh, played a lot of reps. And uh, there's some spots we got some real depth. There's some areas where it's uh, thin in other areas. You know, if we got the wrong guy hurt. But it's so much better than it's ever been, and uh, our talent level is really up. Talking to Robert the other day, he seems like he's just ready to have a huge year. Really feels like he's ready. Can you see that? I think they're all buying in, and uh, I think they're hungry. Uh, I think they want to do something really good, and uh, they seem to be uh, on the same page, care about each other, and playing for each other. So I think that's a good thing. You said Friday that T has that ability to be that shutdown corner that you guys haven't had. I mean, what have you seen from him in the first couple of days? And that's is that. The potential you see. I don't think he's in shape all the okay. way yet. I don't think he's uh, had the conditioning he needs, so he, he can't last very long. But mm -hmm. the good quality reps that I see from him are very positive. I know he has tremendous short area quickness, and then he has that knack that uh, uh, that you want your corner that's, uh, hey, send the ball to mm -hmm. me. I want the ball. Throw it at me. So uh, we'll see the whole package here. What are the couple of areas that you want to see shored up? Uh, or some guys. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean defensive end from last year was a huge thing because we lost them all and uh, we were thin. But I think we took care of a lot of that in recruiting. Then we had, you know, put all uh, CJ's back healthy and 100%. And then we added, you know, Marquise and uh, some of those other guys and uh, see some good things out of the younger guys. That's one area. And then I wanted to see us uh, get longer at corner and recruit longer at corner. And we've been able to do that. Uh, we just need them to rise up and get some playing time. We love our corners, but some of them are, are short, and uh, we wanted to get length at corner. One, one guy's a veteran with length, or kind of a veteran, Derek Jones. How's he doing? Yeah, he's improved a lot. I mean, uh, I think his biggest thing was uh, physically. I think he went against the best, one of the best receivers in the nation all spring. And I think it made him better, it made him see that he had to get stronger, got stronger over the summer, and uh, just keep coming. But I, I love his length. Uh, when I say length there, I don't necessarily mean six two or three. I like a six foot corner, you know, somebody that can uh, the real long waisted ones can't change direction as good. Most of them can't. Derek might be the exception, but uh, those six foot six foot plus guys, um, we're trying to head that direction with our secondary. What have you seen from CJ and Marquis? You know, having been here in the yeah. spring now here for the fall. Yeah, and we're going to create packages for them in certain situations where they're both on the field at the same time. We just hadn't got to it in the install yet, but. Uh, I think they're very difficult to block one on one. I mean, you got to chip them or do something, uh, or they'll beat you. And uh, we got a great tackle in Laramie Tunsil, and, and uh, you know uh, he may be as good as there is in the country. And those guys battle back and forth, so they just get better each and every day. What do you 